So we got a call for a truck that is in a ditch up near Pinto. I guess it's a lot of snow on the road up there. And we're just gonna go see if we can get it pulled out. We've got a whole bunch of yahoos back here. And we got a real treat today because we have the customer with us today. This is Jared. Do you wanna give the weather? <laughs> it's a beautiful day. It's uh, sunny, minimal cloud cover. It's gonna be cold when we get up on top. We'll get them out. be going up on the mountain somewhere so Rhett keeps telling me that there's good places to turn around when he sees them where he wants us to unload the banana I keep denying him that but I'm thinking now I should have listened to him me and Caitlin and Connor supposed to be back for a meeting I don't think we're gonna make it I think you will you want to Pull over right here. Like I said, we're gonna wait till we are in trouble, and it's a double rescue. This looks like a good place to unload the Jeep. What do you guys think? This is a good snow packing thing. Is it? Hey, I gotta get a battery. Hey, look at there it is. This snow's cold. All right, let's build a bridle so we're falling in the middle. Do you guys want to figure out who's going in this truck? I'll go. Rock, paper, scissors? We're going to rock, paper, scissors to see Winner who's in the truck. Winner or loser gets? Uh, loser gets in the truck. Well, can we go on shoot? Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. <laughs> I lose. What's your concession speech? My concession speech? Yeah. What does that mean? It means the speech you give when you lose. Oh. Sometimes you lose at life, and sometimes you win. Today, I lost. Caitlin, jump in there. Okay. And you're just gonna do a, like a medium rare, not like not too, not too aggressive. We're gonna pray this stinks now. Yes. Okay. Got it. Oh, I did it. What was those hand gestures? Let's see if they got it. Hey, yeah. Uh... That was pretty good. That was pretty good. Oh boy, I don't like this. Let it down. <laughs> I love this. This could be fun. Let's get Blue Steel popped out of here first. Okay. Well, that's as far as I can go. Now what are we doing? I'm gonna do a wicked J turn. Everybody stand clear. I'm not responsible for what's about to happen. <laughs> okay, let's get the Jeep. Get the banana down here. Let's spin this trailer around. I think this is going swimmingly. Swimmingly, huh? Yes. That's how they say it across the pond <laughs> in the lower 48. Okay, stop right here. Okay, if this trailer goes off the, off the side, I'm gonna scream. <laughs> I'm going to put on my seatbelt. Okay, Colin, here's the plan. You're going to kind of creep up on this. Uh -huh. Okay, creep up on it. Uh -huh. Go stand on the end of this trailer for ballast. 
Okay, it's nice and slow. It's a great snowplow. <coughs> yeah. Open USA. Yeah. <laughs> okay, we're gonna need to dig away from this. Okay, Rhett. <laughs> we would have the Jeep loaded up right now if we just parked right there. We're gonna try. I'm tired of this. I'm tired of this, Grandpa. That's good. That's good. Okay, all I need is a bunch of ballast on the back. <laughs> We're standing on the foot. Um. Okay. Okay. Caitlin, I need you to stay back there. Okay. Rhett and Colin, I need you up here lifting and dragging with all your might. Oh, this is looking good. Rhett? Grab lower. Hey! Thanks, Caitlin. <laughs> okay, I'm leaving you guys here. I'm taking a Jeep. I don't I'm know about Jeep you. Up. I'm going to go find a place to turn around and load the Jeep. That wasn't so bad. <laughs> right? Okay, let's load up the Jeep. Beautiful. All the way up till it touches. <laughs> uh, yep, there you go. There's one for you. There's one for your dad. Perfect. Thanks so much for hey, thank you. letting us do that, plus helping us with this one. Okay, and we'll just watch and make sure you make it out of here. We're just going to... Okay. As long as you're coming, we're just going to keep burning. Sounds good. All right, that wasn't too bad. I mean, we had one recovery turn into three, but we did them. The kids have missed their appointment, but I don't think it's my fault. I think they would have missed it even if everything went perfect. Right. Yeah, you still brought us on the job. He had capable hands back at home. This is the transfer case out of the banana, and it's broken. It has a crack that starts here and ends here. I've got to get that fixed before the offer of games. I can't wait to meet you there. So we got a call today for a dirt bike that's up in the sand dunes. Guy blew up the clutch, I think, and we're gonna go get it. It is a beautiful day today. Perfect weather to be willing. It's probably like 60, 65 degrees right now. My dad's back at the shop doing, well, things. Heavy record things and getting ready for the game. Working on Robbie's Jeep, something like that. So he sent us on this job. We've got Peanut with us today. Max and Lady stayed back at the shop. We got the trailer in tow. We'll get them out. This is my first time seeing the off-road trailer come out and it, it's really capable. So this trailer has been in a lot of places. It's gone everywhere this Jeep will go. So this will go where we're going today. So that's just to the dunes. The clutch blew up on the sand dunes and the customer ended up pushing it over to some bushes to hide it. Let's go find it. It's like a okay. treasure hunt. I love treasure hunts. He has a trailer. <laughs> okay, I think that he pushed it over here. So let's go walk over here real quick, see if it's there. And then if not, we'll go right over here. But I bet you it's right up in there. Let's go look. Well, I thought this is where it would be, but the customer said he went over a flat rock and then there was bushes that he stashed it in. Flat rock right there and bushes. So I'm gonna go look right over here and if it's not here, it's gonna be down that way a little bit more. So when we used to go sand duning when I was probably like six or seven, my dad still had his old sand rail. This is where our base camp was, was at this rock. And when I was very young, my dad taught me how to get the four-wheeler unstuck. You go behind it and pull it out. Well, I got the four-wheeler stuck on the hill, went behind it, pulled it out, 
and the four-wheeler chased me down the hill and ran me over. That was the day I learned, once you pull the four-wheeler out, get out of the way. I thought it was gonna be right here. This is scavenger hunting 101. How hard can it be to find a bright red dirt bike? So we just called the customer because we could not find it. So we get out, <laughs> we're looking around. It's, it's way right over there. there. He pushed we it found a lot it. farther than I thought. We so thought we it thought was further right down there. Our scavenger hunt is over. Now we have to retrieve our prize. He said it was in the dunes. It is on a trail. It's next to the dunes. It's, it's like next 100 to the dunes. yards. If you ever break your dirt bike, it's a good place to hide it. Yeah, put it right there so we know where it is next time. Alright, what do we got here? Oh man. I love dirt bike riding. I have a dirt bike of my own and I haven't been on it in like four or five months. It's probably been longer than that. It doesn't run, remember that's why we're here? Yep, I'm putting it in neutral <laughs> so I can push it. Oh, it's a 250. Yo, I want to get my dirt bike fixed. Kind of like how Caitlin wants to go rock crawl. I want to go ride my dirt bike. All right, here we go. Peanut decided she wanted, so she wanted, sorry. People are getting after me for not saying things right, like mountain, when really it's mountain. Gosh. Welcome to Utah. Hope that thing stays on there. Should we be doubting you? No, nope, we're fine. There's no way we're gonna be going the long way out of this. Nope. Oh, don't drive the trailer. Still in one piece, we're fine. We're fine, we're chilling right now. Look how pretty that is. That is gorgeous. Run. She's got a little bit of a cactus problem, but that's okay. Uh -oh. Got it. Okay. That'll be good enough for right now. You also can get your own tool bag at mattsoffroadrecovery.com for when your dog gets cactus in their foot. We made it back to the water tanks. Now we need to find the guy and give him back his dirt bike. We made it! Good afternoon. Here we are, boss. All right. That's sweet. Thanks, guys. That's sweet. <laughs> On top. Okay, sweet. Have a good day. Have a good one. Yeah. All right. So we got that out. A little bit of a treasure hunt. Me and Caitlin had fun with it. Got him sent on his way. Peanut got a run. She's got some cactus in her. We'll go take care of her once we get back to the yard. But uh, it's been a great day. Yes, it's been a good day. Thanks for watching. Oh, I'm throw you into that snow. <laughs> Quit singing that. <laughs>